morning Tim, uh, so I just thought I'd make you a nice video uh, this morning. Um, so today is the 27th of October 2020, so tier 3 lockdown in England for coronavirus. Um, I'm outside, um, but obviously that's fine. Uh, so only things like bars and re but like bars that serve alcohol that are closed, but otherwise everything else is pretty much open. Um, obviously I can't get to Japan, which is quite sad, uh, which I'd love to be, you know, on a plane coming. But um, well, there's a few things I wanted to show you today. First thing is this. Look at these. Ah, mushroom. See you in there. Takasan. Yeah, can you see that? And then look. And then what I also want to show you is that this is my, this is our house here that you live in, 186 Buchanan Road. It's where, you, where we moved when you was four. Um, and then uh, I want to also show you something out the back. So here we go. It's going to be quiet because people are sleeping. So we're going to go through here. So this is the kitchen that we painted green now, and it has got some nice pictures on the wall. Here's Chibisuke no To, and then here's some other ones as well. Uncle Ed and Uncle Josh and Cousin Joe, and then Grandma and Grandpa, and then Otto, Auntie Sam, Uncle Ed and Uncle Josh. Right, and then here we go. So we're going to go through here. The other thing I wanted to show you is in this room here. Ready? So, well, it's actually out in the garden. So look, this is the garden. It's quite autumny now. Can you see that? It's now October, so most of the leaves are coming down. And the thing I wanted to show you was um, down here, I grew some cosmos for you because, you know, we like playing Animal Crossing and uh, started these off in June. And look, they're actually flowering now. They've been thinking about flowering for ages and ages and ages. And they're actually flowering. How beautiful is that flower? That's lovely, isn't it? It's got interesting little things on the end. There's another one. And here is your apple tree. And um, what else have we got that you would know about that has been before? Well, I grew lots of sunflowers, but they're all getting tired. And to be honest, the garden needs a little bit of change. And then this, this big pink flower. Um, but yeah. So that's the main thing. Oh, and your strawberry patch, it goes all the way. There it is, there it is, there it is. And even crazy thing is, look, some strawberries are coming in October. And I don't know quite why that's happening, but it is. So, yeah, I want to show you the mushrooms and I want to show you the cosmos. And uh, here's your little tree, which I'm keeping. And then has got a little stone on it, which is one of your heart stones. Um, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna do a video recording for you of a of a book now. Um, it's a classic. It's called Jack and the Beanstalk, um, and um, it's kind of similar. Part of the story from the part, last book I put on uh, is similar, um, and it's a classic from English reading. So I think it'd be good for you to know it, and it's not too long. So here we go. Just gonna shut that door. Right. So. Like I say, it's called Jack and the Beanstalk. Here's the front cover. And there's Jack. And I think we talked a little bit about this yesterday when we were on the phone about um, golden eggs from chickens that could be great if we could sell them and buy an aeroplane and then fly to Japan. So here we go. Right. This book will belong to, I got it second hand, but it's going to belong to Hugo. I'm going to change that in a bit. Jack and the Beanstalk. And there's the uh, horrible giant who's not very friendly. Uh, this is just about how to read the book, but we're just going to play it simple and read it normally. So who's this? Look, and there's a cow, and there's Jack, I guess, and there's his mum. And it said, once upon a time, there was a boy called Jack. He lived with his mother in a cottage. There's Jack, there's his mother. Uh, they were very poor. One day, Jack's mother said, take the cow to market and sell her. So Jack took the cow to market. Right. Look, on the way, who's that? On the way to market, on the way, Jack met an old man. What's he doing? Where are you going? asked the old man. I am going to market to sell the cow, said Jack. Will you sell the cow for five magic beans, said the old man. So Jack sold the cow for five beans. I mean, that's not a very good deal, is it? Can't eat beans oh look jack took the beans home 
I sold the cow for five magic beans, he said. Five beans, said Jack's mother. She was cross. She threw the beans out of the window. Then she sent Jack to bed. Oh, no. <gasps> Crikey. In the morning, Jack woke up. He looked out of the window. There was a giant beanstalk. Wow. It went up into it went up up into the sky. Jack climbed up the beanstalk. Wow, look at that. Imagine if you had a beanstalk outside your window. Where would it go? What would it lead to? At last, Jack got to the top of the beanstalk. He saw a giant castle. Jack knocked on the door. The door opened and Jack went in. Ooh, I wonder who lives in that castle. Are they friendly? Are they not friendly? <gasps> Oh, here we go. In the castle lived a giant and his wife. Fee, fi, fo, fum, said the giant. I want my breakfast. Jack was scared. You must hide, said the giant's wife, or the giant will eat you. Fee, fi, fo, fum. Jack hid from the giant. Okay, he doesn't look very happy. Look, there's the golden egg. The giant sat down at, at the table. Then he put a hen on the table. Hen, lay an egg, said the giant. Cluck, said the hen. And the hen laid a golden egg. Ready? Here we go. Here is your breakfast, said the giant's wife. His wife gave him a very big breakfast. The giant ate his very big breakfast. Then the giant felt very sleepy. Time for my nap, he said. Soon he was asleep. Oh, look. A golden egg, said Jack. I will take the hen. She will make us rich. The giant was fast asleep. So Jack took the hen. Clock, said the hen. The giant woke up. Jack ran. The Jack ran. The giant ran after him. Ah! Quick, get down from the beanstalk. Go, go, go. But Jack had got his axe. He chopped down the beanstalk. The giant fell down. And that was the end of the giant. Oh dear. Bye bye, giant. Then the hen laid a golden egg. So Jack and his mother were rich. Hey, Imagine if you and a car got a golden egg. You could be rich too. That would be nice, wouldn't it? And then these are just looking back at all the different words. That was a very short version of the giant point. Giant, uh, Jack and the beanstalk. But still, no, nice nonetheless. Um, imagine if that was a real thing where you had beanstalks that grew to the sky and there was people like living in houses on the top of beanstalks. That would be strange, wouldn't it? Okay. Well, um, quick video today. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, just to say, I'm thinking of you as always. Um, I know at the moment it will be, I don't know, five, six in the afternoon for you. Um, and, um, you know, um, I know you're probably doing your thing and it's like, sometimes it's hard to know that I can't spend time with you, but I always think of you and I always think, oh, you know, I can't wait till the next time we can see each other again. Okay, well, keep trying your best and, you know, always you can phone me whenever. I'm always available to you, okay? I love you lots and um, hope everything's going well. Bye.